Holy, 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 Nam de Kano is another Savior. Holy, 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 Nam de Kano is another Savior. Holy, 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 Nam de Kano is another Savior. Great people. My great people, freedom fighters, lovers of freedom, my great people all over the world. I am back again today. This is a quick one. You are still on IPOB Rapture Media under the leadership of Mazen Namdi Okukang. I still remain Mazen Okin Naukechuku, known as the Biafran Child in Wachineke, the general. I hope every one of you listening to the leader of indigenous people of Biafra. I hope every one of you understand the words that come out from the mouth of the leader of indigenous people of Biafra. You know, some of you people, I'm not happy. It's not a joy to me that he's still there today. But it's also a joy that he spoke from that court of Abuja. He won all of them that they are causing mayhem in our land. Mazin Namde Kano won all of them one after the other. That the Biafra land must be peace. There must be peace in the land of Biafra. Mazin Namde Kano also understood the reason why he is in DSS dungeon. He said it. That is the reason why he's there. They're trying to, you know, console him. He told them he knows. The reason why he's there. Look at his eyes. You will understand there is a lot of pains in his heart. That those people that he's fighting for are there causing problem. And Oyendu won every one of them that you should stop killing our own people. You should stop it. Now you begin to understand. That our leader have spoken. He have given them a warning. That is why you see today some of them are going on the ground because they know what is about to come. They say that Mazen Nam the Kano cannot speak. They say that Mazen Nam the Kano cannot do this. But Mazen Nam the Oku Kano opened his mouth, said. He knows the reason why he's there. That is the reason why he is there. Because we need our freedom. And he's not going to negotiate at all. He's not going to negotiate at all with any person, with any bagger, with any inconsequential, with any buffoon, with any Nikompu at all that is coming on his way, he's not going to negotiate at all. He knows the reason why he's there. He has said it. That is why he's there for Biafra to come. And he will keep on fighting. Now you see that Mazen Nandekano is also in the court of Abuja agitating for his own freedom and the freedom of his own people. He's agitating inside the court. Now you listen to his voice. And you understand. There is no joy. There is no joy in me. I feel no joy at all. That a man. That trying to liberate our people. From all this mental and physical slavery. And some people are out there. Putting more problems on his health. Trying to cause chaos. Trying to allow the international, I mean, inviting the international community to come and proscribe us as a terrorist group. When you speak, then tell you that you are afraid. 
and when you just mention them, use one article about their name, they will begin, they will come out on social media, begin to defend themselves. They don't want to be called terrorists. They don't want to be called criminal, but they want to target on Mazen Namdekano to be taking everything. Mazen Namdekano have warned every one of you that you should retrieve your steps. Those of you that are causing problems, those of you that are causing chaos, those of you that are killing our people, in the name of the, that you want to, you want to take in charge. In the name that you want people to see you. In the name that today wears an ago, that do this, do that. We are not going to take any order from the man in DSS. But the man in DSS Don John now is in the court. Today being 28, June 2022, agitating for his freedom and the freedom of his own people. He said that is he knows the reason why he's still there. That is why he's still there because he won't be afraid to come, and we will keep on fighting to be afraid so that he restored. That is what he said with anger. Just pay attention to his eyes. Very soon they will say it's audio. Very soon our people will say it's audio. Our leader said, stop killing your own people. Stop causing problems in the land of Biafra. You should stop killing those people that you say that you want to restore Biafra for. Stop killing them. That is what Onyendu said. And I hope that this message will get to every one of them. This message will get to every one of them. Because they are waiting for Onyendu to speak. Onyendu have spoken. Mazen Nam the Kano have spoken. Now you have listened. He have given warning. What is disturbing him? That you people should stop, you know, creating camp here and there, infiltrating our people, killing their own people. In the name of let us go and carry arm. And when you tag them something, they will begin to carry their head. Withdraw themselves. We are I'm not a terrorist. Withdraw themselves. I'm not a criminal. But you want to tag somebody a criminal. Oyendo have spoken. A just a word is enough for the wise for you to understand where Oyendo stands. The man that you people are waiting for have spoken. Now you know that he's not afraid. He just looking towards to restore our dignity. Our motherland Biafra. Have mercy upon this man. You people should stop putting more problem on this man's health. The man that just come into that is care for his own people. Just because of the love that he has for his own people. Now you have heard it. And I know that this will take a path. And those of our people that are just doing their will or their wish. To begin to kill their own people, Oyendo have said it. Stop, stop, and he make it as a, he said it as a warning that you people should stop, and I want you people to stop. Last time Benjamin Madubu said it, nobody believed him. Now Oyendo have said it, so that you can confirm that Oyendo speaks to these people. Now you understand. Good day and welcome.